killing tech executive Bob Lee made his first appearance in court this morning. Welcome everyone to The Four. I'm Alex Savage. And I'm Christian Kafton. The district attorney's office is revealing new details about the slaying, including a possible motive. KTVU's Evan Cernofsky has the very latest on this investigation. Evan. Yeah, Christian, prosecutors revealed that Bob Lee had been hanging out with the defendant's sister before the killing. And something happened where the defendant grew enraged, drove Mr. Lee to a secluded location, and stabbed him three times. Nima Momeni's family arrived in court on Friday morning as the alleged killer faced a judge for the first time since being arrested Thursday. Momeni didn't speak, but made a heart sign to his family while escorted in handcuffs. Prosecutors revealing for the first time the circumstances leading up to the killing in court documents, including that Lee had been hanging out with Momeni's sister, Kazar. Prosecutors say Lee was at an apartment here on the 1500 block of Mission with Kazar and other friends. He then left for his hotel, where Momeni began grilling him on whether his sister was, quote, doing drugs or anything inappropriate. Lee assured Momeni she was not. The two later met at Kazar's apartment in the Millennium Tower just after midnight on April 4th. They were seen leaving on security video in Momeni's BMW and driving here to the 400 block of Main Street where prosecutors say Momeni and Lee got out and Momeni stabbed Lee three times, one of the wounds piercing his heart. Prosecutors said Momeni used a kitchen knife in a planned and deliberate attack. District Attorney Brooke Jenkins had this to say Friday. There was some type of dispute between the two men, um, at least that Mr. Momeni was upset with Mr. Lee about something prior to them leaving her residence. This is a person who was in his vehicle with a kitchen knife. That's not something most of us carry around uh, at all times with us. And so that this was something that he intended to do. Now, Mr. Momeni is due back in San Francisco Superior Court for arraignment on April 25th. He has not yet entered a plea. Reporting live in San Francisco, Evan Cernofsky, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Yeah, uh, Evan, very important detail and interesting detail about that kitchen knife. Are, are we aware at this point in time, or has the DA revealed whether or not they've recovered that knife as part of their investigation? Yeah, and court documents say that they have recovered that knife. They recovered it at the scene where there was still some blood laying around uh, as investigators were combing through all of the evidence. One of the questions we still have to ask, though, is where did that kitchen knife come from? There's been some speculation. I asked the DA if that came from his sister's apartment at the Millennium Tower. She has not revealed where that came from. Uh, and, and Evan, do, do we have any idea of, of what point it was in the investigation when authorities zeroed in on Momeni as their suspect? We're still waiting for some of these details. We know that they saw them leaving the Millennium Tower together. We've learned all this evidence about the vehicle they were driving in. So it's clear that they had a pretty good indication earlier on, at least before yesterday, yeah. when they uh, made that arrest based on the warrant yeah, from the DA's office. That's what it sounds Alex. like. All right.